Right, we're going to show you a quick video on how to mix mortar for laying bricks like that there. So what you're going to need, we've got, in the UK, we've got a Bell sand cement mixer, or mortar mixer, concrete mixer, whatever you want to call it. That's a Bell cement mixer. We've got a 110 box, because it's on a 110 voltage, not the 240 for safety. An extension lead plugged in, obviously you don't need a radio. And then what we've got is a hose pipe for water. Do you want to pick that Feb mix up, Brad, and show them what the Feb mix is? This is a plasticizer. So that there is what we're using. That's a, a concentrated plasticizer. So we're using about 10 mil of that, which goes in here, so you can gauge it. And it, once you get to the line, do you want to show them? Open that up yeah. and just show them how to do it. So what so you do... So there's your, your 10 mil. You yeah. just squeeze the bottle. There we go. Fill it up, 10 mil. And that goes into one full mix. So we've already put that in. There's water already in there, so we're all ready to go. And what we're going to do, we're going to do a four-part sand, which is a, a building sand, so a four-part building sand and a one-part cement. So it's a standard, normal, ordinary Portland cement, OPC. Um, and that's it, basically. So we'll show you. So turn the mixer on, Brad, and uh, mm -hmm. let's get it on the go. Oop. Right, she's got that gauged in the bucket there now. Let's get over here. Oh, I'm trying to show him and you're getting in my way, Brad. Yeah, go for it, man. So you put one bucket in now. We won't do a time lapse, we'll show you it real. So there's two. Check them in. Just put two buckets in so far. Now he's going in for his cement. So you can see now that the bucket is a you gauge in the bucket, so the, the quantities going in are all exactly the same. You're not putting like a, a small shovel full load in or a large shovel full load in and changing the colour and changing the strength of your mix. So he's got his cement in. What you should be doing, and what I would recommend you should be doing, is wear a mask and wear your PPE and glasses which you're going to pick us up on it and we haven't done it but there we are it is what it is so just keep topping up your water little tips clean your mixer as you're doing it clean your mixer as you're doing it so where are we at now Brad you've put two buckets so we got two 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 sand one cement and I gotta make up make up the rest now with another two sand put, I open my cement in halfway through so it mixes evenly. Because you don't want to put your cement in last because you'll never mix the back. Yeah. Says the expert. So that's three buckets of sand. Yeah, please wear goggles. We're idiots. We have started doing it, but... We're not happy today because of the wind and everything. There's no excuse, but we're not wearing it. So don't put your hand or your shovel in the mixer when it's turning because it'll, uh, obviously, you could injure yourself doing that. So is that four now, Brad? That's four. So what we want it to do, we want it to be a little bit stiff and you want to let the mixer do the work. Let it mix, let it mix. Put minimum water in. Try not to overdo it. And let the mixer do the work for you. If, if, if it mixes... And it looks right within two minutes, it's mixed too quick and you've got too much water mm. down it and it just won't be good to use. So when you get to this stage, look. So this is your brick laying mix there. So that's a full mix in there now. So every single mix we do, we'll use the same quantities, the same cement, the same buckets, four and one. And then when you lay your bricks, what you'll find is when the mortar dries out, your mortar will be the same colour all the way through. It'll be the same strength all the way through. And that's what you're looking for. So you've got your plasticizer in, you've got your quantities in. It's just a matter now of leaving the mixer, do some magic and work. So it will take a while to do that. So it's soaking wet now at the moment. So what we'll do, rather than boring you or standing you watching the mix, we will press stop and we'll come back to you in a little bit. soaking wet and then it was too dry just now so now we've left this for about it's only been about five six minutes mm. and you can already see you now the plasticizer is putting air into the mix it's, it's, it's doing its magic what the plasticizer does it makes it more fluffy it makes it more workable so when you put your brick down you can hit your brick down and the cement is not like a gooey mess if that makes sense when you use plasticizer and you don't 
you see the difference between the two, you know exactly what I mean. You can see now, the mixer's doing its magic. It's actually starting to mix. So what we'll do, it's not quite ready yet. So what we'll do, we'll press stop again now and come back to you. Let that mix out, probably got another, what, five minutes again? Yeah. Six minutes. So you've got to let it mix. You've got to let the mixer do what it's there to do. So let it mix. You can have a little look at this now. I know I did say don't put things in the mixer, but I've been doing this a long time, so. If you put that control in there, you can feel that that's nice and creamy. You don't want it any wetter. But if you keep letting that mix now, what you tend to find is you plasticise will make the mix go wetter and wetter and wetter. So that now, I've run my trowel through there, and that is the perfect consistency that all I want. You can see it's mixed. Yeah, you run your trowel through there, look, there's no separation or anything like that. If you come over to this mix over here, look, right? This one's been on the spot now a little while. So you can see that this one is not so mixed. You can, I don't know if you can see it on the camera. You can just about see the separation there. It's not holding together as one, which suggests that it's not mixed as good. If I get a shovel, I'll scroll through this. Out the mixer. I'll put that there. Now next to that you can see now see the difference between that and that so uh, as i move in that you can see that it's completely mixed through and there's no separation where there's that one you can see the difference and you can feel it on your trowel as well so it's the same color look a little bit different mix but it's all the same color which is what we want so back over to the mixer so there we are that's how to do your mix up it helps you be all brick clean it's terrible conditions here today in south wales with this storm franklin or whatever it's called so hopefully it helps you. Leave them some comments below. The only thing I think we did wrong is you didn't wear a mask. So that's up to Brad, because I've told you, Brad, have I? You have do? told me, and I keep saying I'm not wearing one. He's not bloody wearing it. So that's up to him. You, I would suggest you strongly wear it, because the cement is very dangerous. So hope it's helped you. Please like and subscribe. Loads more videos of ours. Have a look through the playlists. Hopefully they help you. And um, see you soon. Cheers.